and we are arriving at the Bath and Body Works outlet. This is the first one I've been to, so we shall see. And as you walk in, the 75% off table is right in the door. It is mostly Christmas items, but they do have other tables like this as well. And they do have two for 22 single wicks. As well as the other candles, there are some gift sets. Here they do have a $4.95 table and there is wrapped vanilla in this store, as well as some of the faceted collection. The other stores are really not putting faceted out. All of the ones that were re-released from the 90s collection are still 50% in this store. A lot of stuff is $4.95, just like the other stores. We have a lot of Fall in Bloom and Midnight Amber. We've got a huge pocket back area. This table has items for $6, including the Berry Waffle Cone Candle, which I love so much. We do have a $7 body care table, and Dark Kiss is here. They do have these four pillars of $3 items, which is pretty exciting. Look at that candle stack. Also have this $2 table, and I did find a couple full size here. Amazing. I went to an outlet. I traveled about 30 miles to check this out, and they had some really great deals, and I feel like I really scored. So let me just show you what I got. This first thing is a wallflower double pack. This is in the scent Vanilla Bean Noel, which I was convinced I didn't like. I think I got that one and the brown sugar vanilla one confused. It was a scent that I didn't really like from my childhood, and then when I smelled this one in the body scrub, I was in love. I really like creamy, kind of like frosting-y, cakey vanilla scents, and this one kind of has that sugar cookie scent. So this is the double pack for the Wallflower, which is the home fragrance refill, and this one was, I believe, $6. And online, these are five, but the online price for shipping on the day I went into the store, it was $10.99 today. Some of the other days that I've checked, it is $6.99, so it's kind of interesting to see how that fluctuates. But either way, I feel like it's a decent price, especially for one that I don't think you can just grab right now since they are getting rid of their winter stuff. So we got this one because we both really like this one, me and my partner, and yeah. The second thing is a Strawberry Snowflakes body cream, and this is one of the minis. This is a great scent, and I don't think I found any on sale at any of the other stores. I did see a mist in one store, but I don't think I've seen this around, and everybody's been raving about it. It's really nice. It has like a light creamy scent to it, but mostly that strawberry, and it's got a little zing. So I do really like this one, and I grabbed this in the mini. This was $2. This is in the $2 bin, so that was nice. The next thing is a shower gel in one of the scents that I recently fell in love with. This one is the Blueberry Sugar Pancakes from the Flannel Fall kind of collection, and it's so heavenly. Like, I love this smell. I pretty much like all of their pancake smells for the most part. I love the fruity and maple coming together, especially with a little bit of creaminess, and I think this one really captures it, so I did go ahead and get myself this one in the gel. I recently got this in the mist so glad to have another piece to this collection because it is really wonderful this one was on the three dollar tier shelf so love that the next two are also shower gels this is in the beach nights scent and i absolutely love this one as well i did pick this up at another store i think on the 3.95 table but this one you guys, the price on this, I was like, oh my gosh, these were $2 a piece. Like, amazing. The scent notes on this is Toasted Marshmallow, Sea Salt Breeze, S'mores Accord, Beach Driftwood, and Creamy Vanilla, and it is so divine. So good. 
super glad to have grabbed both of these. Going through the bags. The last thing in that bag was some hand creams. I am absolutely in love with their hand creams. If you've been watching my channel for any length of time, then you know how much I absolutely love these. The first one I got was the Tutti Fruity Candy one from Easter, but spring is coming up really quickly and this will be available to me. And it does smell really good. It is really fruity but it's not overwhelming or too artificial, if you know what I mean. Like, it's just really pleasant. And this is the only one, so I grabbed it. And there was quite a few of this one, which is the sweater weather. I was just looking for scent notes, but they're not on these little packages. Sweater weather is wonderful, and it is one of my favorite cozy scents. So I grabbed this one as well, two more hand creams, super excited about it because I absolutely love these hand creams. I cannot rave about them enough. Okay y'all, second bag. They double backed it, so you know it's heavy. This one is the candles. The first one is Summer Boardwalk. This one's really pretty because it's colored. And this one, I love that scent. This one is definitely um, a more gourmand type of scent. This has caramel glazed popcorn, warm taffy apples, salty sweet cream with natural essential oils. And this kind of has an airy vibe in the background as if you're outside. It's whimsical how much this transports you. I love this candle. So I did buy two. Spoiler alert. I'll pull another one out. It's so good. There was a lot of this one left and I feel like people were deceived at the fact that it was a summery scent, but it has kind of fall type notes. That apple, that caramel, it feels a little folly, but it's winter and that's cozy. And it's so yummy. It's so yummy. And it has a little bit of freshness to kind of give you that pick me up during the winter cold months. So, Summer Boardwalk, I grabbed two, super good. The next one is Pumpkin Spice Latte. This one definitely has a little bit of coffee note to it. Mm, so good, and the pumpkin spice is not like overpowering. This one, scent notes are on the bottom. The scent notes are pumpkin spice, fresh espresso, whipped cream, natural essential oils really cute packaging too for fall but it smells wonderful any time of year i mean coffee in the house is always so wonderful smelling so this turns out to be a really nice one last single wick this one is one of my favorite scents and I have been in love with it lately. Hand cream, candle, you name it. This one is the Sugared Snickerdoodle. I feel like this one's an old packaging though because this year's had a cute little gingerbread house and snow and candy canes on it and this one has the Christmas present. So maybe this was last year. I definitely fell off the Bath and Body Works bandwagon for a while, but now that I'm back, I'm noticing things. And I feel like this one is one from before. The scent notes on this one are warm spices, creamy vanilla, sugared musk, with natural essential oils. So this is a really delicious one, and we've been in love with it. So I grabbed one of these. All of these single wicks, those all included, every single one of these was $3. So that definitely beats the $3.87 price. So the outlet really treated me well. And the very last thing is a three wick. This is one of my very favorite scents and I just finished the mist. So I don't have any way to smell it. And when I saw this, I just, so excited. 
This one is the Berry Waffle Cone. I know not everybody loves it, but I am one of those people that craves this scent when I don't have it, and I absolutely adore it. And this one's scent notes are Sweet Summer Berries, Golden Waffle Cone, Creamy Vanilla with Essential Oils, and it's very different in the candle. I feel like it's kind of cereally. Isn't that strange how things translate through medium? This one, it kind of gives me like cornflake vibes. Kind of weird, but I feel like once it burns, I might get more of that berry tone. So I'm excited to see and I'm excited either way because it does smell really good. I love cereal scents and I like the milky scents. So either way, this works out great. And the three wicks, this is the only three wick they had and they had a lot. I know not everybody loves it, but in certain areas it sells really well. This three wick was six dollars. So this is also better than the normal stores by a little bit. And I definitely think that's cool. So love it. Super excited to have it and can't wait to burn it. And that is my whole haul from my third round back to the Bath and Body Works, this time the outlet. And it was exciting to go see a store that I probably never would have and kind of seeing what they had as well as what the difference is between the outlet and the regular stores. So that was definitely a fun journey, and if you have enjoyed this type of video, the walk through the store, shop with me, and haul, then let me know by leaving me a like, and if you would like more of this content, I also do nail videos, other haul videos, and a little bit of cooking, gardening, and other vloggy things, so if you would like to join me, go ahead and that subscribe button and if you hit the notification bell then you'll make sure to never miss an upload. So until next time friends, thanks so much for hanging with me!